If you want to connect your PlayStation 4 controller to your Android phone wirelessly, then we're going to use two fingers and scroll down from the top here to bring up these icons. Make sure that Bluetooth is turned on. If it's on, like in my instance here, don't tap it because you will turn it off. Tap just below it where it actually says Bluetooth and that will bring you into this menu here. Then go to details and now we can put this into pairing mode. So we're going to press and hold the share button and the PlayStation button for a few seconds until it starts strobing. That is now in pairing mode, so you can release the buttons. And now you can see it's come up with wireless controller down here. We're going to tap wireless controller, and then it's going to attempt to pair. It won't always work every single time. So let's leave that a while until it connects up. Right, and it says here, wireless controller couldn't connect. So I'm going to tap it again. And this time it's going to go through Bluetooth pairing requests. We're going to hit pair. And now we've got a nice blue light here and you can see it's connected. And when I move around here, you can see it's moving on the screen. If I press circle here, you can now see that I am moving around the screen. Now to disconnect it again, all we have to do is two fingers down from the top and then tap on where it says wireless controller and hit wireless controller here and it's now disconnected. And to connect it back up to your PlayStation 4 again, you will have to use the USB cable. Thanks for watching.